Hi guys, welcome back to the Easy Kitchen. So today we're preparing egg stew with vegetables. And these are the ingredients that I'll be using. This recipe is so, so simple, so quick and easy to make. So let's get on with the video. So first of all, you will need your eggs. I'll be using five whole eggs. You can use any type of eggs you want to use. Then one cup of cooking oil. This is canola oil. You can use vegetable oil also. Some salt to taste. Powdered shrimp, carrots, spring onions, and a bulb of onion. Five fresh tomatoes, nutmeg, curry powder, tomato paste, sliced onions, this is half, edible seasoning. Jamaican hot peppers, ginger, garlic, green bell pepper, bay leaves. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to blend my Jamaican hot pepper with garlic, ginger, and just half of the green bell pepper with half a bulb of onion. Blend everything together and then proceed with the stew. But first of all, I'm going to pour my one cup of oil into my pan. I, when it's hot, I'll add my sliced onions. This is half a bowl. So in all, I'm using one and a half bulbs of onions. This is the blended mixture. So I've poured that into my oil. So I'm going to add about three tablespoonfuls of tomato paste. Stir it up and let it cook for about three minutes. Is that supposed to look like? So now I'm going to blend my fresh tomatoes and pour that into the tomato paste also. You stir it up and you cover it, let it boil for about 10 minutes. So after 10 minutes, I'm now going to add my salt, powdered shrimp, curry powder. So basically now you have to add all your spices. So I added my curry powder and my nutmeg. Addable seasoning, so basically just add one teaspoon of each of the spices to your stew. Stir it and cover it and let it cook for about 10 more minutes again. So at this point, I'm going to add my carrots or any type of vegetable that you are using. You can use any type of vegetable for this stew. Then I'll add my sliced onions and my green bell pepper. The spring onions will be the last vegetable that I'm going to, I'm going to add. Because they are soft so you don't want it to be so mushy mushy so you add it at the last part and then I add my two bay leaves you stir it up again then you cover it and let it cook again for about five more minutes so at this point the stew is almost done so now we're just gonna crack our eggs whisk it and pour it into the stew make sure your stew is almost done before you add the eggs because the eggs are the, the last thing that you're going to add to it so now pour your whisked eggs onto your stew. Then use your cooking spoon or spatula to kind of open it up to make sure the raw eggs are going everywhere. So afterwards you cover it, you let it cook on low heat for about 10 minutes. And this is how it's supposed to look like. So afterwards you use your spoon or your spatula again to slowly stir it up from the bottom. To make sure that the eggs are, are broken into big chunks that makes the stew very attractive so your egg stew should be looking something like this and this is so simple like i said earlier so afterwards you serve it with your best carbohydrates it can be rice yams or even plantains oh i love them with plantains but today i'm serving mine with rice and I'm garnishing it with just a little bit of the spring onions, the green part. And it looks so nice. And it's tasty also. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And have a great day. Bye.